Hello YouTube, this is former Republic of Ireland International Key Tracy. I'm just going to give me a quick rundown of the Bulgaria game tonight. Uh, how I think it's going to go. Uh, I know we need we need to avoid relegation to to stay in, in this pot for the World Cup qualification. Let's just dive straight into it. Do I think we're going to win the game? No. I think it'll probably be a draw which will mean we will avoid relegation. Uh, there's a couple of factors in this. We're missing, we're actually missing 13 players from our original squad before the other two games started. So eight of them, to put that into context, 13 players missing, eight of them are Premier League players. When you when you think of how scarce we are at the minute to be having eight Premier League players missing for a game against Bulgaria, it's it's tough. And uh, it looks like James Collins is going to start up front. Leading the line. You know, McGoldrick was the number one. He's gone, which you'd probably put Connolly now as the number one. He's injured. You know, James Collins is probably third, fourth, fifth, maybe even sixth on that list. And he's starting up front tonight in a team that lacks goals. So I can't see a scoring. I think if we score, it'll be a Shane Duffy header or, you know, something like that. You know, a knockdown, a quick, uh, something scruffy in the box and we'll score. I think we'll be passive in possession again. I think we'll keep it well. I think we'll have 60-65% of the ball. But the only thing is the Bulgarians are missing their captain. They're missing their goalkeeper and their left back. Which puts them at a disadvantage because they're, uh, they're quite scarce on their, on their players as well. So it's probably close enough to two striking second string teams going out there. It's who who's going to perform better on the day. I, I, the way I see this going is us having a lot of the ball, a lot in front of the Bulgarians. The Bulgarians will camp in, they'll play for fouls in, in their box, they'll play for fouls all over the pitch and they'll pump it into our box. It's whether or not we can defend that. We have a very leaky defence at the best of times, so, you know, with, the, with Seamus and Matt missing at the back, I think it's going to be very, very difficult to keep the Bulgarians out. And if the Bulgarians score, we're going to have to score two, which, you know... <laughs> Small miracles. I, I, I can't see that one happening. So, to sum it up, if I was going to Paddy Power now, I'd be putting probably a one all draw or maybe even a nil all draw or, you know, 2 1 to Ireland if you want to be optimistic. But it's going to be a very tight game. I just hope we don't get done on a, a silly set piece or, you know, something like that. But, you know, hopefully, hopefully I'm, uh, hopefully I'm wrong. Hopefully I've, I've, I've read it wrong and I can do a video tomorrow saying how wrong I was and. I'm quietly impressed, but as for that, I, I, I don't really. We've played seven, one none, but I think we're all we're all quite we're all still behind Stephen Kenny. I think we can see progression in the football, and let let's be honest, this this Ireland team that's going to play tonight, they're not going to play as a team together again. So it's it's very hard to read in read into any of the games he's played because there's always been somebody missing or, or you know a COVID case or something's happened into Stephen Kenny's squad at the minute so you know it'd be nice for Stephen to get the squad and you know play three four five games on the bounce with with his best team what he believes to be his best team and then we can start to actually think you know what, what are we doing here how are we looking at the minute it looks like it's going to be okay it looks like we're going to be a decent footballing team moving forward but we need a Robbie Kane we really need somebody to start putting the ball in the back of the net you know, do I think James Collins is the answer? No. Do I think Aaron Connolly is the answer? Possibly, but I like to use him out on the wing. I think bringing him in through the middle, with you know, with him being so small, you know, any balls, any fighting balls, you would expect him to lose. I know he's lighting it quick, but I, I prefer to have a focal point up there, somebody who can fight for the ball and have a little man running off. But you know, listen, that that's a uh, that's getting uh, that's a uh, a chat for another day. But hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll see how we get on tonight and. Hopefully I'm eating me words. Good luck.